Hi guys, thank you. Now we're coming to the intermediate and advanced drills for improving the, the tracking of the ball. And as you know, we're trying to get closer and closer what it will be the reality when you are playing tennis. So when we're playing tennis, what's happening a lot is we're moving. We're not just standing or static still. And we still gotta track the ball with both eyes. So what we do is this. In this uh, exercise, what we're gonna happen is this. Because the ball move and we move, we're gonna try to do two things at the same time. So what's gonna happen is we're gonna use first the, the, the hand chart and then the wall chart. With the hand chart, what we're gonna do is we're gonna move it back and forth. I'm gonna try to keep the third circle in the middle. We're gonna move the, the hand, the hand chart circles one way, circles the other way. Then what we're gonna do, we're gonna move the hand chart up and down like the tennis ball because tennis ball is changing the height as it's coming to us and we have to do that then with the wall chart okay we keep the wall chart in there and what we're going to do is this we focus on the wall chart we do the eye exercise and we're going to do it we're going to hop because when we hop the eyes are going to move up and down and everything's going to vibrate and we still got to keep our eyes locked then what we're gonna do is we're gonna move side to side and we're still trying to maintain the 3D image on the, on the wall. Now, as we get better, we go down the, the ladder. The farther the circles are away from each other, the harder it is. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna move back and forth, which is forcing you to adjust your eyes gotta go in, eyes gotta go out, eyes gotta go in, eyes gotta go out. This is because we're starting to look more like a tennis player. The fourth one, exercise is we can basically rotate the footwork movements trying to keep eyes on the ball moving and if you see when we move up and down eyes gotta be adjusted so we try to keep the third circle in the middle as we do all these exercises i hope you're starting to enjoy and you're starting to see why we're doing what we're doing i'll see you in the next video with the elite exercises